So, uh, you here for a job application or what? Something like that. Nice. If you don't mind me saying so, your particular choice of attire is maybe a little, I don't know, off? For a job interview, I mean. My suit is at the cleaners. And you couldn't find anything else to wear? Correct. You must lead a very interesting life, my friend. You have no idea. So, Mr... Hmm. I never did catch your name. Names are for friends. Very well. Straight to the point in all business. Walk with me. Where are we going? Hello there. Don't worry. What am I gonna do? Kill you in broad daylight. I just want a bit of privacy here. Not about to do sensitive business like this in front of an audience. Good idea. So just to get this straight, you claimed in your email to have somehow found internal reports that show Kronstadt's involvement in the Tungan Valley Massacre. Sounds about right. Let's be clear. You and I are having this meeting because my father doesn't need to know about this. It's just another undesired distraction. I don't care if the information is true or false. I don't care if it mentions moving money from the Nexus Project into Tungan Valley Damage Control, as you claimed in your correspondence. I do care about protecting my father, which is why you and I are now here. I see. Leave me alone for a few minutes, guys. Sure thing, Miss Knox. Uh, if you need us, just call. We're right around the corner. So here's the deal. You hand over the documents and leave, and that's the end of it. And you will do that now. So here are the two possible outcomes of this meeting. One, you will leave this place and this country for good, and that will be the end of it. Everyone lives happily ever after. Two, you don't choose option one. Someone dies. Huh? Both targets down. Well done, 47. Head for an exit, and we'll speak again soon. <laughs>